Welcome back. This is Tinker77. Today, I think we're going to start a modded series. This series is called Q-Tech, and I'm inspired to do this by Iskal85, uh, who is working on this right now on his streams. And it looked kind of fun, and I haven't done a modded series on YouTube in a while, so I thought we would do this. Now, I'm going to do this in a little bit different of a way, guys. The idea here is that I will kind of just play like 20 minutes straight and then use that as the video that I post. So there may be some longer segments in here. Um, you'll get to see all the derps and the various things I do. I don't intend to do a lot of editing or cutting as this goes on, okay? So bear that in mind. This series will be kind of more often with videos coming out, but they will have a lot of stuff that's kind of grindy in it, okay? But So we're gonna get started here. We're gonna make a single player world. We're gonna create a new one here. We're gonna call this is my, uh, let's see, what are we gonna call this? Tinker 77 YouTube world, right? It's going to be survival, but I do want to put uh, the cheats. I want to have cheats on so we can get things like game mode and things like that, just in case uh, something that we have happen, you know, it's it's available to me just in case, okay? So we're going to do that, and we're just going to create a new world. We're going to go in here right now, and we're going to see what goes on, okay? Here we go. And we got to get this little thing here, and we are now 100%. We're joining the world. Now, uh, we have to get started pretty quick here to figure out what's going on. Wow, it's dark right here. <laughs> We're in the shade and we got to figure out what's going on with this world and what we need to do. Now, the goal of this pack, from what I understand, is there's this Q-Tech tab and the advancements tab that built into my, uh, Microsoft, built into Minecraft. I work a lot with my Microsoft at work. Anyway, built into Minecraft, um, there is this and it says this advancement tree guides you through the mod pack. The end goal of the mod pack is to create the most expensive solar panel. Okay, so we're going to kind of go through this. Various tabs will open up as we play. And so we're going to get started right away here. We're going to try to make a campfire. So we're going to go out here. We're going to go look at a campfire. And you can see here it takes some wood, takes some sticks, and it takes some flint. So we need to do that. And we also need to kind of, like, you know, try to figure out where we are. I'd like to get into a little bit more of a plainsy area. See if we can find some sheep really quick for some uh, wool. Um, we're near a beach and there's some turtles okay let's go look this up see if we can find anything really quick before we get into like building stuff not seeing much right now that's kind of a neat little cavern that could be kind of fun to work with um i'm looking around here we do have a big map up at the top left corner and i'm kind of looking at that too to see what i can see there's some sheep that's awesome so we can use that and it's kind of a plainsy here it's kind of noisy too but this might be a good area to kind of start up maybe over there. But we got to get some wood here. And we got to get some tools. I think that's the best thing to do. Let's get this done. Now, I don't believe that there is any type of vein miner or ore extraction here. So I've got to mine everything separately. And we'll just have to do that. And that's kind of part of this grindy process. So we'll have to do that. Wow, that guy's really loud in my ear. Let's get the whole tree. Now, I don't even know if it has the fast leaf decay. We'll see here when I get done with this last log. Hopefully it does. Looks like it does. Okay, so we've got all the little things here. That's good. Uh, let's make up some of those. Get a crafting t table. And we're going to go out here. Now, um, I think we should make probably an axe. Oops, that's not how you do an axe. Yeah, Tinker can play. Hi, sheep. You came up here to be the first one to get hit. I am so happy for you. Here you go. Welcome to the video. Thank you for the wool. Right, now we're going to go on here, get the other ones, and hopefully we can at least get a bed, and that will help us sleep through the night, which is always good to have when you're when you're playing, right? Okay, so we got that. Two wool. We need to find one more of those guys, and I hear them in my left ear. There they are. Hi. Okay, there we go. Make sure we can make a bed. That way we can have at least a little bit of a start and won't get attacked so much at night. Let's see, can we make a bed? That's the other question. Did the recipes change? Because in mod packs like this, recipes do change. Okay, we do have a bed. There we go. That's awesome. Um, now let's go and look around just a little bit before we start the whole process. I mean, this is a great spot and all, but I want to look over here. Uh, I like the fact that it has this area that kind of looks kind of clear. There is some water there. I don't know. See, the whole thing is where to start. You got to kind of set up a base and get going. We're going to do this kind of like together here. I'm going to look over at the area up here on this hill. 
and see if this looks okay. Because it's nice, it's got a nice little plains area over there with some boating access to the ocean if we want. We have some horses, that's kind of cool. And we have a bunch of various trees. I don't know, this could be kind of a nice area just to set up a little temporary base, little house and things like that. Something where we can get access to tools and minerals and other things. I'd like to find a village if we could. Uh, but I don't see anything yet on the map. I'm going to go around here, just around the corner, just to take a look. Got a little bit of a forest over here. Some more sheep. That's good. We can get some more wool. And it looks like we have a desert over here. And that's kind of good, too. Having a desert nearby could be useful. So, there's this hill. Hmm. Decisions. It's always like, where do you make your base starting out? That's always a tough decision, unless you've uh, had time to look at the base starting out, you know. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, maybe we'll go over here and these are nice, nice tall flowers. Go around the corner, just take one quick look. Nice little pocket here. This could be like a little bit of like a, an area. If we were to flatten this out, this could be like a, a area that we could use, put up some fencing around. It could be like a basic starter area. I like that idea. So let's uh, let's do that. We're going to fill this in a little bit and level it out. So I'm going to put the crafting table here. We're going to make um, a campfire in a second. But let's get, uh, let me get a shovel here. Let's do that. Shovels are kind of useful for gathering resources like dirt. And like I said, we want to level it out just a little bit. And that was my phone. I don't know who's calling me. If you can name that tune, put it down in the comments. <laughs> I don't know if you've even heard it. Uh, yeah, my phone just rang. <laughs> um, okay, well, let's get this tree down. And we're going to get some food going here pretty quick, it looks like, too. And we do have some mutton there. We can cook that up. And there's probably some quests for that or some advancements. I guess it's not really quests anymore. It's, it's advancements now. Um... So let's let's do that. Let's go get some stuff here. So we've got to make a campfire. Okay, and we need basically we need logs, which we got some more, and we got sticks. We need to have flint. And flint, is it a special recipe or is it just get it from gravel? Looks like you can do things normally, but we can get it from probably from gravel then. So uh let's look at the map. Over that way is the river area, and there probably has some gravel over there. So let's go look. That's not the river. Okay. And I didn't set my home location. I got to remember to do that. So we're going to do that when we get back. And we'll put the bed down over there. Did I even grab the bed? Yes, I did. Okay. We're getting there. Start. This is the start of the series stuff that you always have to do, you know. I think I said that there's a river over here, correct? Yes. And I can't even run anymore, guys. I'm, I'm going so slow because I don't have any food. Um, I could... There's some gravel. That's what we need. We got to get some flint here. Okay, we got a couple pieces of flint. That's good. Um, let's go on back. Oh my gosh, this is terribly slow. I could, like, eat one of these and give me a little bit, right? Ooh, we got one haunch out of that. That's not too great. But it gets us moving a little faster. Oh, we got lots of pigs. And you know I my disdain for the pigs. Yep, the pig, the pig of destiny got me many times, a long time ago. Okay, so there's our crafting. Let's see, we gotta make some sticks. Yeah, there we go. And our flint. And we make a campfire. And that's awesome. We have a campfire now. We'll put down there. And it gives us some light. We are going to uh, put down the bed probably too. Uh, somewhere. I got to fill this out still. Let's put it over here. Make that our bind point. And now I'm going to do set home. This allows me to be able to teleport back. Okay. Now, I believe we can cook right on the campfire, can't we? Can we just place these down? Yes, we can. And there we go. Now I'll cook that up for us for some food. 
Looking back at the advancements tab, we've got this. Now there aren't any like rewards or anything. This is just stuff that you have to do. So it looks like there are some things here. This is a crafting a smoker. So as you can't cook food in a furnace, I didn't know that. So uh, we'll have to make that probably next. We also need to get uh, some chest and some storage here soon. So let's get that cooker. Nope, it's not called a cooker. What's it called? It's called a smoker. Okay, and this is basic Minecraft stuff. It's a furnace and four logs. The furnace is all of that and a torch. And a torch is coal. But if you put a stick on a campfire, you get a torch. So let's just do that. There's our some food. Put that right there. And we have some food now. And that's awesome. Let's eat. So um, this is one of the things that, you know, with, with modded, you can do various things. Um, ouch. To get to the same process. So if you didn't know to put the stick on the campfire to make a torch, you know, you would try to go to get some coal, right? Or charcoal. And charcoal you can't get without a, 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 a furnace, which we need a torch to get the furnace. So you can't do it that way because you can't do that first. And coal you have to basically mine. So you'd have to go mining just to get this, but we did it a different way. And that's one of the beauties of mod is there's lots of different things you can do. Okay, so we're going to make a furnace. And for that, we need cobblestone. So let's, uh, and now I'm getting a message. I really should turn that off when I uh, record. We need to get that. There's a pick. We need to go and get some uh, mining done. And I might actually mine right into this hill. Um, like right in here, we'll go and have a mine, right? Like that, and hopefully we'll get some materials here. There's a, uh, oh, it's that icky diorite. Just figured we would go right into a diorite pocket first, but that's okay. There's some cobble. And it looks like I'm getting a message for some reason. We can make another torch here. And this is, what is this stuff? Slate cobblestone. That's interesting, but I would like to just get regular cobblestone. So let me get some of this right here. We're going to have to get some torches so we don't have things spawning around our little, like, mini base here that we're starting out. There we go. Okay. And it's getting dark. Ouch. We're going to sleep through the night. That's awesome. Wow. Okay, we've already recorded 13 minutes. I'm, I'm amazed. Okay, let's make a... Oh, golly. we got to make another torch because I used it. So there, we'll do that. And I have 12, which means I can probably make a stone pick, which would make that go a little bit faster. We can still then have nine cobblestone for the uh, furnace that we're going to make. Okay, we got that. That's really dangerous. We're not going to be doing that that much. Okay, and we got a furnace. And then with that, we need to make a smoker. And the smoker is that. And there we go. We have a smoker now. Come on. There it is. I'm going to put that over here, and that way we can cook up some food. Now, we don't have a lot of food yet. We're going to have to work on that pretty darn soon, and there we go. We got that. Now, strain yourself. Craft a survivalist strainer and put it in a strainer base next to a water source block. Well, we can always, I guess, we have water near us, but we can make a little, like, pond. I don't think there's any water um, except for that little water pocket that's over there. Okay, let's go look at this. The strainer, right? This device here is looks like it's got some chests and stuff, so we're going to need a lot of wood, and we don't have any, so let's start chopping down some trees. I'm going to do that right now. There's a couple of these trees here, and of course we can always replant. We're going to have to make some chests for storage. This is kind of like how it goes during a stream. It's just kind of a, a free flow of everything that's going on, uh, but we're going to do this a little differently in that I'm going to be playing this. I'm trying to kind of not really editing things out that much. Maybe some things with big grinds like loading screens and things. But for the most part, it's going to be just you and me playing the game just like this. So hope you enjoy it. It's kind of a different way to do it. I thought it'd be fun to play Q-Tech and play some modded. And you're, I know that as we go, people are going to be like screaming at me saying, hey, you need to do something else. You should have done other things. And that's great. So if you have any comments or anything that you would like me to do or a better way of doing something, 
that you know of, let me know. Put it in the comments and let me know, okay? So we need a strainer here, which we're gonna need some some chests, so. This will make chests, I hope. Yes, it will. And you know what? I'm gonna make uh, two more of those because I'm gonna make a double chest here for us to start storing stuff. So uh, let's put it right back here. One. There we go. And that's how we can store some of the stuff with us. Okay, we're gonna make the strainer and we need to get some planks. There we go. And we have a strainer, that's good. And it said to make a survivalist strainer and put in a strainer base. So we've gotta make a survivalist strainer, that's this here, and it makes sticks, that's easy. And we need string to, and how do we get string here? Well, we can use a wool card on a thing. Hmm, string, that might be an issue here. So we craft a wool card on wool, and this thing is, uh, yeah, no, I don't have any iron. That's not gonna work. This could be bad if we don't have a way to get string. There's various fibers. Sinew fiber gets, dried sinew can get a string. Sinew is, uh, you dry that in a furnace, we can do that, and where do you get sinew? Is there a way to see what sinew is? Nothing there. I think we get that with animals such as pigs. I think, let's go get some pigs. Um, I want to not kill everything. I like to have like, just so I have resource there. Uh, we got a uh, raw pork chop. Okay, let's go over here and see if we can get some sinew. I think it's a animal product. And yes, it is. Okay, so that's good. Oh, you're a baby one. You go first. You're pretty resilient for a kid. We have two sinew. We might like to get a little bit more of that. I guess it doesn't drop as much. Okay, so let's go on back. We now see I I can do home, and if I wait for three seconds, it will teleport me back. So that's why I did the set home. That's very useful. Okay, so we have to get a furnace again. Is that what it said? We have to cook it in a furnace. So we're going to need a torch, and I need to get some more materials here. So let's do that. And let's get some more of the cobblestone. Fortunately, now we have a stone pick, which makes it go a little bit faster for us. My intention will be to staircase down here so that we can go, may have like a deeper mine and get some more resources. But for now, we're just doing some startup stuff. This is some, some basic stuff, getting food and fuel and resources, right? Okay, so there's the torch and we need to make the furnace and the furnace on this recipe in this pack is this and a torch. Okay, so there's our furnace and I'm gonna put it right under here. Okay, now they have to cook this and I don't know if we have charcoal and someone else is calling me and I gotta turn that off. Let's do that right now. <laughs> Okay, so let's get this uh, furnace powered up. Uh, we got to make charcoal. I think we can make charcoal, can't we? Charcoal is just uh, any wood in that block. So let's do that. Uh, put that in here. And let's... Uh, we'll do that and we'll get some charcoal coming up here. We're almost out of time. I'd like to go and shoot for around 20 minutes. While I'm waiting here, guys, if you want to play along, that is the seed... And I will try to put that down in the description so you can cut and paste that. So if you want to play along, you want to like work out where I'm at or do things, you can do that. So there you go. Okay, so we have some charcoal. Now we have uh, put that into here and let's cook up the sinew. This will be done here in a second. Takes a little bit. And all this is like the rabbit hole. That's one thing that modded does with you is it has a rabbit hole. So you say you get this right here, and then you put that in there, and you get three fibers. And of course, we need four, so we gotta wait for this other one. This is just so we can get the mesh, so that we can get the thing. You know, it's 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 a process. Okay, so we have that there. We have four of that, and then we need to make. I think it was uh, four of these and a stick, wasn't it? No, just the four things. That's right. There's a string mesh, and we need a strainer. We're making this right here, and that does take four sticks. So we'll get four sticks, and we'll hit that, and there we go, and we have that. Okay, and that's all that was for that particular advancement. Now, we're going to go over to, I'm going to say we're over to this area, and I might need to clear a path so we can do this, but we just have to put some stuff in a water source. Now, 
the strainer here, this thing, I know it, I've used this before, and even though the water surface, you know how there's a block here, a source block, if you put it right here, it doesn't work. You gotta go actually one block deeper. So we're gonna put that in there, and you can see it has, the reason why is it puts those uh, posts there. And then you put that on, and that puts the mesh around it, and now what this thing is doing is it's slowly gathering resources, okay? There's no problems here. You can see it's kind of going up. It's up to almost 70%, 80%, 90 and there we are. And what we get, we got raw bitumen, which I'm not sure what that is for. So, you know, and this is one of the great things with modded is it has this thing on the right side here and you can go look at it. I can click on it. This tells me how to make it. But if I press the letter U while I'm hovering over this, it shows me the uses. And so I can make a block of it. We can make a, some asphalt and we can make some more asphalt and some more asphalt. And there we go. So mostly it's for making asphalt. So that's great. But look, we already got an iron. We have iron nuggets. So this is fantastic, okay? So let's get back. I could use home, but it's just over the hill. We're gonna be over here. And I'm gonna go on in here. And we're gonna just take a lot of this here and put it there. We have eight pork chops. We can cook that up in the smoker now, I believe. So let's put that here. And let's just take the charcoal. We Hopefully it'll go fast and it will go, I'll do all of it. We're gonna see about that. And I'm gonna put the rest of this in here, I can keep, I don't have the ax. So we have a shovel. I guess I lost my ax, I don't know. Um, but yeah, we're doing okay here. It's a good start of a of, for the series. So that's awesome, okay guys? Anyway, here we go. So I'm doing this, this will be kind of fun. It'll be kind of us playing modded together. It'll be a little more long form, but short videos that come out more often. So anyway guys, I sure hope you like this video. Hey, if you do, please click that like button. If any comments, put them down in the comment section. And if you'd like to be notified of the videos that I produce, please subscribe to this channel and don't forget to hit the little bell icon so you get all the notifications, okay? Thanks, guys. Have a great day. Bye-bye.